Hi guys, welcome back to the Medics of Life channel and this evening we're gonna dedicate time to take a look into a relationship between uh, Zayn Malik and Gigi Hadid and we're gonna see how uh, their daughter changed their lives, okay, and uh, what are perspectives for this couple, for this very interesting couple. Uh, why so? Uh, because they break up and get together so many times and their relationship always been um, looking rocky and karmic from a side but what's really there uh, okay let's try let's try to explore this evening so first of all uh, the question number one uh, you want me to answer uh, what's going on in love life for Zayn Malik now? What's going on in his lo uh, love life now, right now, at the current moment, the moment of this reading, okay? Mm -mm. Which events may be taking place in his love life? Seven of Pentacles. Five of Cups. And six of pentacles. Wow. A lot of pentacles and cups upside down. You see here, this person kind of reminiscing over past days. Um, concerned about finances as well here. I am seeing, despite he's rich and famous, but I see some, you know, as some sort of troubling thoughts about finances maybe because this uh resp new responsibilities he had now taken uh, taken into account that he had daughter now uh definitely not much going on like everything put on hold in his love life he is more into finances now and he uh, missing old uh, wonderful days uh, not seeing that still um, not able to find you know joy in a present moment all his thoughts especially about his love life they all resolved uh, around past you know everything he is thinking about now past days in terms of love um, not seeing much of passion, not seeing much of, um, you know, pleasures, no just material concern and like non-equal give and take in relationship, sort of he's feeling used but um, telling himself, okay, let's wait and see, uh, despite he's feeling used but he remembers old good days and just uh, telling himself, okay, let's wait and see where it all heading, okay, in his love life. Uh, okay, now let's take a look what's going on in Gigi, Gigi Hadid, right? Yeah, Gigi Hadid, love life. In her love life now. Very passionate love life, I, I would tell you. And, <laughs> and some secrets, she's holding some secrets, I'm telling you. Uh, because this is in my personal spreads. Um, it's card of lovers, of cheaters, of love triangles. So <laughs> definitely she's having sex with someone and uh, looking at what's going on with Zane right now, I wouldn't say it, it's him she is mingling with, okay? And Herophant, yeah. Secret uh, of um, a secret <laughs> relationship hidden from family, from family eyes, yeah. Queen of Wands, oh gosh. I'm telling you, she's having someone else on her plate and that someone else is really well hidden 
and she's not going on to break anything with Zayn because here I'm seeing you know like uh, you know this fish piranha uh, so she like piranha from this Amazon river um, stick with her teeth to the source of uh, marrying someone or to keep her marriage going on or to keep her official public relationship going on while behind somewhere there is a cheating definitely <sighs> wow I didn't expect this okay okay let's ask now what's going on right now between these two we just asked what's going on separately in her love life, in his love life. But what's going on between these two? Between them together? Well, any man wanna pop up. What's going on between these two together? Gigi and Zane. The Emperor. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Stability, king of pentacles, someone giving money to someone and big money and knight of swords, a lot of fights I'm seeing, you know, um, sort of cold uh, relationship, cold sword with a lot of fights, a lot of uh, like gossiping and trying to figure out truth, uh, but between them Man is showing responsibility here and financial support and woman sort of trying to um, you know the sort of woman who pointing a man their mistakes when this not enough that not enough this will be never enough um, this sort of energy I'm getting from this card what whatsoever he is doing trying to stabilize things just like king of pentacles doing the woman not accepting she is meeting him treating him with her sword and uh, very quick and fast judgment here and a lot of fools and I'm getting like this way of behavior uh, narcissistic behavior here and made to distract you know narcissists they create some arguments to distract you from a fact that they have lover or lovers so they just eating your brain with a teaspoon and trying to distract your attention onto something else so while you will be sad trying to analyze what just happened why he or she stick that you chewing not right or you didn't take napkin uh, while you eating your dinner or that you just left your shoes next to door and they not you know like 90 degrees oriented on uh, south or north or whatsoever this sort of energy I'm having from her towards him not just create this little 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 fights about nothing about just such a shit that it's like nothing uh, to distract his attention and while he will be thinking what the hell is going on she will be calmly cheating with whomever she needs um, but man here is definitely showing responsibility and a lot of financial support so yeah showing his best qualities let's say even earth qualities i don't remember when he had his birthday in january something in january i think 12th of january but a lot, a lot of earth energies it's like his energies i i'm telling you and this is table one uh, a, a man who want to get married want to come with solid offer solid offer to her but she is this let's say black cat yeah this way okay let's ask about future of their relationship this is what going on now 
the future uh, of relationship between these two Gigi Hadid and Zayn Malik future of their relationship and we asking for mm. another half year part of yeah for half year it's optimal okay what's gonna happen between these two eight of swords someone can't leave can't go can't walk away and not free to express himself devil again devil it's a cheater's card a lot of cheating when in a uh, compatibility matrix of two people we have in some uh, devil energies devil arcanum is definitely this couple 100 percent want it or not one day you will figure out that your partner spouse wife cheated on you and you will need to deal with this one way or another okay but this always comes if we see um in one of the major positions if we see this energy energy number 15 okay cheating future cheating and sex addiction and four of pentacles and not letting go here's not letting go of someone i don't know either it's him not letting her go either it's her not letting him go you know like this narcissistic sort of hoovering and devil as well as my narcissist card in narcissistic spread so she's a huge narcissist i'm heading didn't expand this anyway you know her better from what you follow in because i don't know her at all i'm just um I'm just translating your language cards. Talk to me, okay? Um, we'll be waiting for your comments on this situation. How do you feel about GG? But here, future of the relationship, someone not letting go. Like Piranha, I told you, like Piranha. And here, someone not free to walk away because of this. Uh, addiction unhealthy love adrenaline love i call this unhealthy passion towards another not free to walk away and prefer to keep the eyes binded you see uh prefer not to see what's really going on and what's really going on is cheating under this person knows okay wow that's crazy Okay, let's ask now a question about his paternal qualities, how, how good um, he is as a father right now, because you know, our kids growing up uh, and we growing up as well with them, we're changing, um, we're changing our attitude and this everything, but at this current moment, let's ask about his paternal qualities, okay? How many time he's spending with his daughter and so on about his paternal qualities let's ask four of cups you know he's very much focused on daughters that not sort of not seen even like not seeing you opportunities career opportunities or something else he's too much focused loving your broken heart some sadness i'm getting here how good father he is um you know he's very critical uh he constantly criticizing himself he is thinking that i should be better i should be better i should be better and a fool it's very new role it's very new role for him and on the one side it's very difficult for him to find a balance so when he is with with his daughter he's spoiling her enormously and spending maximum time with her without any distraction on on work or whatsoever um, but he's feeling you know like guilty that he either isn't good good enough father uh, either he was not able to give her something 
and it's very new job for him very new experience so honestly he doesn't know how to behave how to deal with this he's only learning and um, a lot of guilt here a lot of self-criticism he's constantly criticizing himself for his parental qualities okay let's ask what sort of mother is gg hadid model what sort of mother she is Temperance, very balanced one. Ace of Swords and Strict one. Let's say cold even. To some extent. And three of wands. In general, just to summarize, she is a big kid herself. But as mother, she is very strict. Very cold. Uh, she is the one who will be... Pushing her kid to pursue some goals of hers. And very, very balanced. She isn't the one who will be spoiling kid or something. He will be spoiling, okay? But she isn't. She will say, no, we're not buying this. She's very little, we're not buying this. She will grow up fast. Mm, very balanced mother, very balanced, uh, cold, strict, and wanna be proud of her kid. I won't be surprised if she will be involving her kid uh, into a model business or into some sort of any shit business uh, from very early age, just pursuing her own goals, not kids' goals. But uh, she have a huge desire to to be proud of her. Mm, kid okay she has this huge enormous like ego she wants her kid to be bright successful this everything and she will be pushing her kid strictly pushing her kid into uh, this so i think in one or two years we're gonna hear something related to this that her daughter somewhere was modeling, was some kid stuff, kids wear, kids whatsoever, or played in a movie, or whatsoever shit, because uh, she has this no energies to uh, wanted to make a candy out of her progeny, let's say, and doesn't care much about uh, kids' desires or talents, or no. Oh, well, very interesting here, very, very interesting energy, guys. Um, okay. Um, also, you sent me a question, will they get married officially? Some, some sort of this I got. I don't know, either they, they may be already married, who knows them. Uh, but you sent me this question. I am not into this topic, but I will ask it for you. Any any marriage coming? Most likely they're going to get married officially. You know, like ten of Wands, but some obstacles like related to work or something. Yeah, Ten of Cups, very, a lot of lovers cards, family cards, but for someone it's going to be a heavy burden this marriage yeah most likely in nearest one year they're gonna um, you know not a tie and get married officially yeah but for someone it's gonna be tough decision and it's gonna be like a burden i'm getting here have a burden but burden you don't want to let go of okay so yeah, forecast for them very optimistic in terms of marriage here. Maybe Miss Piranha gonna push him finally. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Is this what Card saying? Okay. Um, and um, just you ask me. Uh, uh, maybe we will see some important events coming for Zane for the nearest three months, sort of. Okay, any important events coming his way? Something life changing you asking me about? Okay. Seven of Cups, a lot of dreams, a lot of you no know, castles. Nine of Cups, but some of dreams he gonna make true, may make come true. And eight of Cups, you know, like 
And uh, the most interesting fact, yeah, I understand how they came. Now he's passionately dreaming about something. And this something gonna happen within the next three months. Something he's desiring with all his soul. And this wish gonna be granted for him. But when he gonna get this, he would say, rather I wouldn't. Because there will be a desire to walk away. Because um, this is gonna appear not what he dreamed how it will be or something like this. Is that after his dream comes true about something, he will feel this desire to walk away and like wish that this uh, wish never came true for him. I see this regrets, you know, I see this sort of depression. Oh, and yeah, depression falling, my, my uh, it's nothing happened, you know, there is no such thing as coincidences. It's fallen, you know, depression, fa like fallen star, fallen sun, sun is down, sun is down, <laughs> see this, sun is down, it fell down for him unfortunately guys and you asked me to ask about his future album i don't know if he even writing one taking into account was what's shit going on in his love life uh, but some artists like harry styles are taking shit and making candies I'm not sure if zane has this uh vibes as well okay magician yeah definitely he's working on something big project hermit and yeah in secret in a secret so just very few people know that new album is in process guys here but ten of pentacles and yeah it's gonna be really successful uh album which might even overshine this harry styles uh glory then but oh uh, you know it's not revealed to public yet and just very 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 few people know that on what he is working currently actually okay so my beauties i will ask you if you like this reading please support with likes comments shares in comments please you can uh, write down a petition question for the next readings about zane okay please um, because i i can decide i can choose either to do about zen and harry styles relationship i either to do about something else okay so let me know what you want to see here uh, me answering and so in order not to miss video hit subscribe button and notification bell so you will be always you know receiving fresh news not like tapping into this video like months later okay guys i wish you a wonderful evening and hope to see you soon here all around bye bye